Hello and welcome back to Marion Cat's Plays Death's Gambit. When we last left off, our intrepid hero had finally slain the Forgotten Gian, or Gian. I'm still not sure. And we picked up a number of extra shards. Um, so we have options to purchase items. Um, ooh. You could buy new fragile courage. Cool. Mythal Greaves? Dope. We're gonna have to remember that this merchant is selling these. Absolutely. Um, we are going to probably pick up this bow. And you sell a nice sweet axe? Fado's axe. I think we have that. We're also gonna pick up this crest of Gaia. Which is essentially a, a key forward. There's something over here on the right that takes it, and I think there's something down below that takes it. But we're not gonna go below and we're not gonna go to the right. We're gonna check something out that. Rude? That should be pretty new to me. Go on. Shouldn't. Shouldn't should or at all. It's, it is new, is what I'm trying to get at. Oh, that's right. I should equip my new bow. Cinder bow, go! Oh, five finesse. I didn't look. Oh. oh that's two levels. That's not anything to... <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> okay. Pay attention to your surroundings, Mary. Oh, here we go. Do you keep a list of all the people who have died? A list? You think I use such mundane organizational methods? Maybe. But it is organized. So would you be able to track a person? Or rather... Uh, your request is well above your service. Is this about your mother? The one from your death? She did write off, and that was kind of the most regretful moment of our life. We stewed on it as we were dying, after all. Yes. Is she alive? I have not buried a soul by the name of Everly Galbraith. So there may be hope yet. That was a very carefully worded statement by death. He has not, or I guess death is not any one gender, but they have not ferried the soul of Everly. Which means... Whoa. Oh. <laughs> Oops. I uh, seem to have accidentally rebound my weapon one to the bow. Let's fix that. There we go. I was like, wow, something's different here. Um, so she's not dead. That's the only thing we know for certain. She is not in limbo. She's not in this unnatural flux state. She's not in any of that. Um, or not confirmed to be any of that. She's just not dead. Which is good news for Sorum here. Um, as he's probably looking for her. Just in general. That's probably why he joined the military to begin with. He needed answers. Whoop. Nice. I probably didn't need to do that. Could have just let that crush him. But I don't think I would have gotten the experience for that. I'm just gonna ignore you. Ow, fuck! I shouldn't have ignored you! Yeah, I think... I think there's some na something nasty ahead. Probably the phoenix. It's the phoenix. Shit. <laughs> Soul, the phoenix? You got some kind of sickle situation. I'll burn your soul to ash. Oh, little dot damage. <laughs> I didn't expect a boss fight so soon. 
Jeez. I can see the rage in your eyes. Well, this is gonna take some effort. All right, let's try this again. Round two. Are you gonna be surprised, or is the phoenix just kind of a known quantity to you? You are unworthy to stand beside true immortals. Nah, you're not surprised. Oh boy. <laughs> Alright, I should live by the counterattack. Okay. You've got a hell of a reach. No, no, no. Okay. I've got to use my shield more. Alright, I feel much better about this opportunity right now. Uh. I feel as though now we're getting some actual progress. I haven't taken too much in the way of hits, she says right before she gets absolutely drilled. Okay. That's a sick back attack, by the way. Okay, well. Um... You have died every conceivable way. What? I actually think it's a talent. Did you invest in it? <laughs> um, who do you know? Who should we talk to? We go again. No, really. I mean, it's almost as though you ran into it on purpose. I... Uh, no, no, no. Yeah, I'm trying, man. I'm really trying. Stop pestering me. And that other time? No, I'm honestly seriously getting better. And the other time was... I get it. <laughs> Ready to die? Oh, that's directional. I'll burn your soul to ash. I've learned something. Oh. What do you dream of becoming, Soren? I'm going to be a soldier, just like you. <laughs> I'm glad. But you know I wasn't always a soldier. Mm, I don't know. <laughs> You'll have plenty of time to figure it out. Just remember, whatever you do, give it your all. Okay? I will remember that. Because that's the only thing Storm's good at. 100% giving his all. And then dying from it. Okay, she got a good hit in. Oh, there she goes. From behind. Burn. Oh. I'll burn your soul to ash. We got her! From Ash. Oh, we haven't even spent our previous talent points. Immortal defeated. I feel like that needs more fanfare than it gets. Let's see, regenerate stamina faster while blocking. That seems very useful. Um I should be targeting like the big ones. Okay, so here's what I'm thinking. This ability here, dead center in the middle, blessing of protection, seems like a great option for someone who has used up all of their feathers into bolstering their um, uh, bolstering their damage output instead of leaving them to be 
Estes Flax style heels. Uh, so potentially, I I should I have three talents. I should be able to unlock it. So, okay, that plus this one using feathers when over ninety percent health removes minor status elements. I will probably find a feather in my adventures, so I'll be able to use that once or twice. Um, regenerate stamina faster while blocking. That just looked good in general, because blocking? Absolutely. It's a must. Woo! Look at that. Blocking lowers the time of any abilities currently cold down in two seconds. That seems very cool. Once I finally acquire an axe, that seems amazingly cool. So let's... Oh, I could even pull back the feathers I have. Ew, how about I do that? That way I have at least one feather. Do we want more finesse so we can use that bow? That seems smart. Yeah, let's use that. And we'll save the rest for purchasables. Where's that bow? Center bow, type two slot. Not only does it come with more arrows, but it's hotter. I think. I don't know. It's it's called the Sinner Bow. Oh, and we are going into the frozen north. What is going on back there? Ow! Traps! Obsidian Veil. How do I stop that? No. Oh, there is something going on back there. <laughs> Those traps do a lot of damage. I didn't even notice. I was too flabbergasted by the, um, ritual. That's the word. All right. You know what? You might, you might be friendly. <laughs> no, you're not. Oh. You are a monster! Ow. You're not that difficult, though. You open yourself up a lot. Crystal Great Hammer. Well, do go on. Requires 20 strength. A weapon that deals heavy damage, unwieldy to those who lack the strength, but devastating in the right hands. This crystalline weapon is both beautiful and deadly. Okay, so moral of the story is level but level up your strength. Strength builds. Okay. We're okay. I'm gonna Seeing that crow plume it reminds me, I'm going to do this. Just in case we need a bail out of the situation. I don't like this. It's a freaking wizard! You're a wizard pup! It's amazing! You're a dead wizard pup, but. Not without causing me some significant problems. Sweet horn. Medicinal plume. You don't say. Restores 290 health when consumed. Dispels basic negative status elements. A plume from the legendary Phoenix, unleashing its natural radiance, has restorative properties. You may still believe the secret to immortality lies within the Phoenix. Now such a promise seems negligible. Interesting. 
240 reduces damage received by 30 for four seconds. Hmm. 290. Since we have just the one heal, I'm gonna say let's go for the one that does more. That was like a full heal. That's so good. Huh. Okay. Well, shoot. Well, I guess we want to get to that, don't we? Ow! Nice trap setup you've got. Now you're dead. Crystal bombs? Sick. Shoot you in the head. Oh, is there more than one of you? There's like some kind of wizard. Yeah, there's a wizard. Okay, you're actually a really simple. You're huge looking, and I like what you drop. Nice. I don't know if you noticed, but um, my uh, healing effect went off. Spawn, all right. Dragonberry, all right. That healing ability is gonna save my butt. Do we go to full 20 or what? <laughs> no way! We almost can! Oh, God. Um, let's try uh, some of the way there. Let's, let's hang on to the shards in case we come across something that we want to purchase. Ow. Rude. Oh. Hello. Gotten Gi and we didn't get the second one. It is unknown whether by chance or fate the Amarogs discovered they could achieve immortality through ritual sacrifice. The green crystals are a byproduct of their ceremony. Really? Green crystals, you say? Hello? Wh are, are, are you not a conversationalist? You must be the sacrifices. Judging by the the cave paintings. Fine mess you've gotten us into, you bumbling oaf. Oh, now he's gonna be talkative. Hey, Namira. Silence, Pop. You there, standing around. We've run afoul of these wolves. I've noticed. I shudder to think what might become of me. Probably a sacrifice for immortality. You mean us? In. No. Rude. Mind uh, releasing me from this cage? You've got a sickle, don't you? I'll have to find a key first. Thank the gods. The more I listen to her yap, the more I welcome death. Uh, I wouldn't be too hasty with that one. Death is kind of a sass. That can still be arranged. Yeah, you. nothing would change. <laughs> Okay, let's let's see if we can't find this key. Requires a monkey. Yeah. We'll get there. Huh. Oh. <laughs> I was like, surely this won't work. It works. <laughs> well now I wanna know what he dropped. Oh, Crystal Lizard! Ow! Dicks! You're just gonna... lightly tag you. Want my feather back, thank you. And... where'd you go? Where'd you go? Dicks! It's still... it evaded me! I'm gonna say we can't do that yet. Oh, you burn. 
Well, that's cool. I didn't realize the cinder arrow burnt things for that length of time. <gasps> Feather upgrade! More feathers! Awesome! Coming over here was well worth our time. Okay, we'll be back. What lies down here? Oh! Well, don't mind if I do. Oh, I think I know where we are. Yeah! Hey! Alright, well... It doesn't change much. Do I want to murder him yet? He seems to really want to die. Comment section, if you wouldn't mind, let me know. Does that snail man deserve to die? He's He literally asked Sorum for death. Son of a biscuit. Okay. It's gonna heal up. Get out of here. Finally got my feather back. Had to use it for healing, though. It's fine, as long as I have it. Um. Well, I guess. I guess we gotta go forward, cause that. That path is dead to us, for the most part. Cool. Alright, let's see what's down here, because I kind of forget. Oh, right. That. It's just a pile of me's. A bunch of dead me's. I must get some kind of sweet jumping ability in the future, because... I'm seeing a lot of areas where I could get to if I just had some better hops, but I don't have better hops, so... Yeah, I'm kind of SOL in that regard. Alright, let's let's rest here. I kind of want to give um, this boss man that gave our... Hello. Uh, uh, you're here. Sweet, you've got amazing abilities. The next time I uh, make a um, a spear person, I'm calling you. Ione, what are you doing here? You've done enough damage already. No, 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 no. Ione, talk to me, talk to me. You, why are you, why were we fighting? Tell me more than just you're trying to end all wars with war. You've done enough damage already. <sighs> Ione, we should work together. Girl, we could do so much good together. Think about it. The war to end all wars. Only ours is better. I wonder if she'll go for my offer. See, I wanna I wanna fight this boss over here. But I'm gonna do it at full health, damn it. Don't go all the way down. I'm gonna, I'm gonna call my horsey. We're gonna go all the way to the right and then all the way to the left, and then we're gonna go fight the boss up there. The all the way to the right, I believe, is a dead end. But is there an item? Only opens from the right side. Okay, I thought there might have been an item. I, I knew it was a locked door, but wrong. I'm guessing that comes from the city that we want to get to. Holy shit. Holy shit. I forgot there's dudes down here. Thankfully, our horse makes short work of them. I forgot all about this. 
You, uh, you might have noticed that little poison meter. It's it's basically like Dark Souls. Um, Spellblade, yeah. I, uh, something for wizards in this game. A weapon for wizards. Uh, it's basically like Dark Souls. You've got a, a tolerance meter. I killed you with my horse. Horsey, why you do this? Are you okay, Horsey? Um... I need an adult! Okay. Everything's better. Everything's all better now. I think. I hope. Bye, rabbit. Yeah, okay. See, this is just going to be our shortcut to the boss, basically. Um... Yeah, we'll heal up here, and then as we need to face the boss, we'll just come down and ride to it. Take as little damage as we can, essentially. It's interesting. This game takes so much inspiration from... Um, like, uh, Castlevania Symphony of the Night, uh, from its level design, that in some ways you could look at this as almost a Metroidvania of sorts. Um, you unlock paths and shortcuts, which is a very Dark Souls thing to do, granted. But, uh, you know, Metroid and Castlevania did it first. In, respectively first. Um... It, it's interesting in that way, and the the horse is almost like your speed booster from Metroid. You plow through obstacles and creatures. Interesting. So, here we are at the boss. In later fights, you'll see someone in the background who might be of some interest to you. It'll be up on this first column right right up here. So watch out for him. Infidel. Your devotion is found wanting. Oh god, he does a lot of damage. But we've got two nearly full heals. We should be okay. So we're, we will strike when we see our opening. Like, there. So he does like a, a three hit combo in phase one. Here, he's open here. Ah. Our strength is infinite. You are only one. I'm only one, but I hit really fucking hard and my nose itches. Okay, much better. What? <laughs> Holy shit. I had not seen that before. I just rolled into that. I haven't gotten this far, truth be told, in the fight. What? That's a lot of damage. Okay, we're out of heals. That ghosty figure does a lot of damage. Oh god, now you've got a sickle. I'm feeling it. And it hurts. Can't you just be happy knowing that you're a legit badass? Maybe ask me some riddles or something as opposed to trying to beat me up. Feel the fury of the Woo! Ah, 
damage. Okay, dodge, dodge, dodge. Now get in there. You see it's charge meter. It's handy that I can one hit kill. Oh, shit. I can one hit kill a lot of these weaklings. Okay, don't give up the ghost yet. Your ends here. Our strength is infinite. You are only one. Oh fuck. Damn it. Damn it. Feel the fury of the It's gonna be hard to beat that one. <laughs> I did so good. We go for round a two. Line between determination and insolence. And I don't know what that line looks like. Okay, these cinder arrows might be one of the best weapons I could have gotten for the counterattack ability that I get. <laughs> Our strength is only one. Whoop. Just gotta knock him down and move on. Oh, you notice who's in the background? Hold on, he's on the left side. our dragon friend from the very beginning of the game. Our strength is infinite. You are only one. Your arrogance ends here. If I die, he finds it very amusing. Your arrogance ends here. Are you sure my arrogance doesn't begin here? You might have it backwards. I haven't quite figured out that one yet. God damn. Your arrogance ends here. This is where the spirit dies. Yes. Yes. Fight! Ow. Okay, let's full heal. Practically a full heal. And get in there. Jeez, you are really tough. Feel the fury of the heaven. Woo! Okay. Got you tagged for a little bit of damage. Ow! God, those mines are rough. Okay, I'm gonna let the reinforcements come. And then, murder, murder, murder. Okay, it's good. He's very vulnerable when he does that. Ah, oh, damn it. It leaves a little minefield. I'm just gonna heal through that. 
So now, victory is practically assured. Assuming you know he doesn't absolutely decimate me with a combo. Okay, I'm just gonna have to dodge his mines. You remind me of her. Who? Quickly speak before you die. God damn it. I'll take that. What do we hear? Um, requires 30 strength. All right. Hey, friendo. What do you think of that, huh? Mighty hilarious how I didn't die this time. Though that was that was what round two. I think too bad considering, in past iterations of this fight, with my finesse build especially, he got, ooh, quite a chuckle, quite a chuckle out of my constant death. Anyway, the path is clear. We can. Uh, we could head over to the next town. I forget what it's called, but death really wants us to go there. And I think that's going to end this particular episode of Death's Gambit. Next time we go blind into the next area. Hopefully we find an axe so we can actually start using our special abilities again. That would be nice. Thanks for watching everyone. Until next time. Take care.